All right, so last Thursday, after it was clear, Democratic Senator Raphael Warnock beat Republican challenger and former football player Herschel Walker for the last Senate seat available, the one from Georgia that would give Democrats the true majority in the Senate. Well, late night host Seth Meyers was talking about how Republican strategists were lamenting the fact few GOP senators made the trip to the Peach State to endorse Walker. Seth was questioning whether the missing ingredient for a Walker win would have been a surprise appearance from some faraway senator, like from, say, Wyoming or even Idaho, to which he then took it upon himself to offer what that might sound like having never heard Senator Mike Crapo speak in his entire life. Just going to have to guess what he sounds like. Let's see, Idaho, okay, looking at the face. All right, I think I got it. Here's my best guess for Idaho Senator Mike Crapo. Hello, Georgia voters! <laughs> it is I, Mike Crapo. I am here to sweep you on my feet with my charm and charisma. And that was today's inaccurate impression. Inaccurate impression might be an accurate description. Did he nail it? I don't, I mean, he did say that it was an accurate impression. How about this? Let's take a look and see him side by side. Hello, Georgia voters. <laughs> it is I, Mike Crapo. I am here to sweep you on my feet with my charm and charisma. It's too many taxes, too much spending, too big of a burden on American people across all income categories. Not, not, not quite, but good job, Seth. I think you nailed it. Probably not, no. You know, we did ask Senator Crapo if he would like to offer his own inaccurate impression of Seth Meyers. We're still waiting to hear back.